Hey guys, so Mission Control got an update today and it added a service tab which allows you to control everything that System MD is currently running, which is amazing, by the way. Let's just go with that. And two failed services out of a total of 211. I have failed services. Why? That's weird. And I don't remember ever installing virtual box services, but there they are. At least I know they're there and ready. Which ones failed? So the Jupiter one failed. I don't really care about that. And the Jupiter controller service failed. So that's normal. That's normal. I was doing experimenting with other things. So this latest version of 1.5, again, that's a new service page. And it also works for OpenRC. That's pretty cool. Now, there's also the graph changes. So in other words, um, there are, you can control your refresh and your polling interval and customize chart data points, new graphs, uh, hot plugging disks and things is, is supported now too. And I believe that there's a lot more information going on here as well. Yes, there is. So now we have more information. If we look here, where is it? We can now see that we're on power save at the moment, which we're totally not. I don't know why it says that. Let me just try to change that. And we are using AMD P state, but I don't know. I don't know why it says power save. We're not supposed to be on power save. You can see that we do have virtualization cat uh, compatibilities and everything, which is really nice. So it allows you to see your frequency governor. Okay. Now VRAM usage has been reduced and UI and UX elements uh, have been tweaked to ensure that it looks better and behaves more consistently, which is nice. I want to check to see if they reduce the amount of RAM that it used. Uh, not really. But let's go check on the VRAM usage because before that's me recording. God damn it. It's going to be a hard one to check, but it probably is a lot, you know, better than it used to be. Hey, look, we're at 34C. Yay. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this little quick update for this. This this application just keeps getting freaking better and better. Honestly, I'm super impressed with how things are going and the developer's super nice too because he actually stopped by my video and yeah, I like when developers do that, it's nice. Anyway, don't forget to subscribe, to like this video and uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Man, this thing looks fancy with some blur on it, don't it? Bye everybody.